This is a Seminole County Centennial Minute. Seminole County's early schools were held in homes. Teacher Anna Raybinder taught children in Geneva. Often the schools were log cabins like the Gore Lake School, and all grades and all ages were taught in one room. In 1916, the voters elected Thomas Willingham Lawton to be the first elected superintendent of schools for the new county. He served in that post for 35 years. In 1902, a high school was built in Sanford. Today, it is the Public History Center operated by the University of Central Florida. Oviedo's two-story brick school was the pride of that small town in 1922. Classes first through 12th grade were taught and there was a gym on the top floor. Meanwhile, Sanford expanded to a bigger high school. In 1927, Seminole High School opened on French Avenue and served students until 1961 when it too was replaced and the building became a junior high. From these first graduates of Sanford High School in 1907 to the 65,000 students now served by Seminole County Public Schools, the standard of excellence has been upheld in education. Seminole County, celebrating a century of success.